Charlie, it's great to have you here. Really appreciate you participating in the program. I know you're going to be presenting tomorrow uh, around some of the solutions that General Dynamics Health Solutions has to offer. Um, how do you define program integrity and, and what place does it have in the state healthcare market? Program integrity is the essential framework by which we validate the appropriateness of the payments going to providers and suppliers for our Medicaid beneficiaries. Um, when you consider that $3 trillion or more um, are expended each year for health, um, and you consider that a conservative estimate is about 3% of that is fraudulent, you see the, the impact that that potentially makes on the healthcare market. Um, so it is extremely important for us to try to mitigate improper payments when appropriate. And what are some of the specific examples of Medicaid fraud? Right. Medicaid fraud takes many forms. Um, some of those frauds could be committed by providers, billing for services not rendered, upcoding services to more expensive procedures that weren't rendered. Uh, in addition, beneficiaries can also commit Medicaid fraud, enrolling in multiple states and getting benefits from multiple states. So Medicaid fraud takes many forms. Okay. And, and given the increased uh, costs of fraudulent activity, what are some of the simple steps to improve detection efforts within healthcare organizations? One of the first things an organization can do is use technology to help in the detection of fraud, waste, and abuse. Um, historically, you know, people used to look primarily at the human element as being the detective in, in the fraudulent activity. However, now we have technology, and so it really um, behooves us to use technology in order to detect the fraud more quickly and use the human element in order to investigate the fraud and validate it. Okay, now there are a significant number of technological tools uh, available to combat fraudulent activities. Can you explain why the, the human element is so important? Humans are able to look at data in a different way than technology. Um, for example, you could have a healthy person and all of their claims data looks as if they're a healthy person. However, they could suffer a heart attack. That's not something that technology would, ne would normally catch. So the human element is extremely important in ensuring that you are validating allegations of fraud, waste, or abuse. As organizations look to implement program integrity solutions, how do they ensure those efforts are actually working? One of the first ways that they can ensure the efforts are working are to look at the provider behavior, the claims behavior. If they're educating providers initially based on what they see and they're monitoring those providers, they can see whether or not that behavior is resulting into an impact on the bottom line and ensuring that those, the claims patterns are being caught. Um, in addition, just the return on investment and looking at what types of ROI should you expect to see on a technology, on a human investigation, um, those are all things that would provide you with a result in terms of just how beneficial is this program integrity um, work coming along. Jala, thanks for sharing your thoughts. Really appreciate you being here. Um, I look forward to, to learning more from your presentation uh, in your session tomorrow. Thanks again.